Okay, I'm making this video for this AquaTech fish filter for five to 15 gallons. Comes with these filters. That's basically what it looks like right there. With all that. Now mine currently is humming a little loud. water isn't doing very well either. I might, I might change this filter out. Yeah, it's pretty bad, but not what kind of causes it to go over that right there. You have the same issue, but anyways, I'm going to show you guys how to fix that humming sound. So first of all, I turn everything off. So filters off, heater and everything else shut off. So, I have this moved over. This isn't usually like this. This is usually over there. Anyways, back to the fish tank. Um, so, what you want to do is grab this part, kind of lift the filter and put it to the back, and then pull this part out. So you want to take this tube out, like kind of the down stem of it, kind of just set that over there, and then get this main component out right here. Kind of get the water off, and this is your main issue this thing right here likes to be loud and kind of annoying so let's see what I do so this is what I kind of do you want to take this piece and piece off Make sure there's nothing really on it. Clean it up if you have to. Um, take this piece off. And kind of clean this off right here. And then the next step that you want to do, get some Vaseline like this and it's completely safe with your fish. I mean, if it's safe for a baby, then it most likely is fine for your fish. And I've done this about two or three times to get this filter to stop vibrating and making noise. Anyways, so you just get a little bit of Vaseline. I'm just gonna put a little bit on there. The rest I'll put that back because you don't need that much. So you just initially Get it on there, and then slide this piece back on, push it down, take it back off, and take that excess off. And then put this back on like that, and maybe get a little bit of Vaseline on this piece, just a tiny bit. And then you want to put this piece back on. Click that in, and you're all ready to go. Get this set back up over here. Try to get like the best angle on this. And then you'll just want to put this piece back in. I'm going to go ahead and put a new filter in too so the water can be, can, I mean so the filter can be better and the water won't be going over that edge. Um, kind of let 
let this drip as much as possible. Grab a new filter. Got a stockpile. We'll always have like extra of these. Shake this around to even out that. And then we want to throw this in like that. Kind of get that in there. Seeing my fish are pretty cool. I got some Neon Tetras, Danios. Um, so yeah, those, those are my fish that I have. So you want to get this, reattach it. Just have it like that. And then kick it back on. Be a little loud at first, but once the water starts going, it'll clear up. Kind of just takes a second for the filter to get going. But I've had these filters a lot, <laughs> I've gone through a lot of them. Um, this is the old one that I had. I pretty much just get them from Walmart and they're cheap and expensive, but they do have problems. This is the way I figured out how to make them last. And that's just putting some of this onto those pieces and just use a little bit on it. But should be ready to go. It's a little bit quieter, I've noticed. Sweet. But yeah, that's how you fix the Aquatech 5 to 15 gallon filter. Anyways, 